We are making instruments from household items. And today, we're making a wind chime out of a coat hanger and some metal objects. This is a truly fun one to make. I've taken lots of different things like washers, you can take keys, I've even added some of my favorite jewelry, my bracelet, I added my necklace, put a little decoration on top of my necklace. You can have your kids go through their jewelry box and pick out some of your favorite jewelry. It's really fun and it's colorful and it sounds really good. So, I'm going to show you how to do it. What you'll need is you will need a hanger, keys, some tape, scissors, anything with metal, and some ribbon. So, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take the ribbon and we are going to cut different sizes. You've seen a little bit. Start out with a little bit of ribbon and we're going to thread the ribbon through the washer or metal object or key or jewelry or whatever it is that you're threading through and we are going to attach it to the end of the hanger. Tie it on. You could use jingle bells too, I think that would work well too. Okay, so just like so. And I think if you do as many things as possible, it might be super fun because you get all these different images. Um, I like having the butterfly, the thing that said dream because that inspires me. And you know, you could even have a chime of all inspiring words. That could be fun too. So take a key, thread it through. You might want to do different lengths, one shorter, one longer, one shorter, one longer, just for texture. You can want to continue all the way down the hanger, and once you're done, you're going to have a beautiful wind chime. And I like to sing a little bit of lullabies too. Johnny, we're going to sing a lullaby with our pretty chimes. Don't say a word Mama's gonna buy you a mockingbird 